Okay, so I'm going to try squeezing with these pliers. Doesn't matter where it says. Hmm. It did squeeze. Better than I thought it would be. Pretty interesting. It's not quite square now, though, but. There's a tight fit on there. There's a tight fit on there, which we don't want to be tight on there. We do want to be tight on that, but not this. All right, so. The fun part. Making it stick. Special lubrication. Special. 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 Get the grease off. Squeeze that back and the squareness a little bit. I'm just gonna beat on it'll beat on the square. We'll see how that works. Alright. So what's the chance of this working? Um well you're gonna have to try it one way or another. So, slim to none, but what the hell? There you go. <laughs> ah, I think it'll be better than that. <laughs> slim to none, but pretty damn close. Uh, You're going to drill the hole through so it stays in place? Yeah, they go in with this Loctite on here. Well, that's uh, what, sleeve Loctite? 80% chance it's going to work. Maybe 90. There's 30% chance it'll blow the gear in pieces. Okay. And, you, and that's the, you bought that gear. No, oh, did you buy the gear or did you just... No, I own the gear. Yeah. I use the clamps. Yeah, well... Once again, these clamps are not made to clamp that direction. Or... Different type of clamp. So... I'm going to try this kind of clamp. No, look at that. There we go. There you go, double, double whammy here. Go any further. Well, I have no choice. That was not the part it was supposed to go up on to. I know. I think I knew that. So, this thing had a little bit of a chamfer it was on the other side than what I was beating on. So, now we need to put something here so that you can beat that on. Yeah, well. You never listen to me. Oh, oh, he finally got the vice grips out. Fred was right. No, not quite. <laughs> I'm not that far either. No, I, I would just stick him on the damn... I know, but I'm going to try my way first. Hang on, let me do this. Yes. Do this channel lock. Oh, never mind. You could have done with channel locks. No, I can do it with channel locks because I used the pressure to get it started. You're such a brilliant person in your own mind. <laughs> yeah, we didn't know how much pressure I put on that thing before it went on. Yeah. You seem to be spinning in the circles. Yes, but it is going on each time I do it. How about if we pull from the two sides? Well, if I had another pair of channel locks to grab on the toolbox, I'd like to do no, that. No, I'll do that. You do this, and we'll pull it together. That's all right. 
It's just spinning around. It's spinning around, but it's going down each time I do it, Fred. Mm. Is it further on than it was? Mm. Yeah. I'd like to go home <laughs> sometime tonight. <laughs> that would be my point. Uh -huh. Not trying to beat it simultaneously. No, never mind. Tilt them all the way down and a beat on it. That's a good idea. I'm going to put a different position here now. I suggest that's probably the smartest thing to do. Ooh, it's getting close. It's pretty much all the way down. Yep. All right. The tube. Tube that baby. Tube it. Let's go. Beat the snot out of us. What you're saying? No, I'm saying. Here you get that damn thing together quicker. I get the hell out of here. Oh shit. I think I'm done after this is. You're done after all this playing. So what was the percentage chance again? Well, I think we're at 90 now. That it's gonna break? Oh, that it'll break? No. Well, hang on. Let me get on this side. Let me get a close up of the break. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Hang on. Ooh. We might have success. Dip around a room. Mm. Precision depth indication. Ooh. Well, let's take that out and hit the. It's not centered. That's you need this centered. Yeah, but you got. You know, you know it's still gonna work in this spot, but yes, there. That's it. Now you're right. Now you're correct. Now I'm correct. It didn't even break yet either. Well, what a what a, what a what a you know the transmission's probably getting heavier. But. Every time I put more stuff on it, it's heavier. Well, I don't know what the reason for that was, but. Okay, now the end shaft. The bearing's still in. Look, there we go. You can see there it is. A little goop. Got a lot of gobby goop on it. Yeah, you might stick it right in the right way. Going the right dray is better. Yeah. All these other pieces are loose. Ooh. Ooh, there we are. Pretty damn close. Pretty damn close. And look how you spin it. And it spins. It doesn't wobble. It hasn't broken yet. So it appears that maybe it'll work. Once you grab that thing and see if it even fits in here. What the hell does it do? It's a speed sensor, right? Oh, well, I see now. I see you said the blind man to the deaf lady over the phone. It appears that the dry ass o ring is splitting. Goop. Put some goop on it. We have to put a new O-ring in there. You got one? Yep, yeah, I think. Oh, oh, he got it. Sweet. Okay, rotate the tail shaft and see if it makes any grinding noises. No grinding. No gr It's not hitting? No. Damn. You mean that it? looks like a new piece there. It was new, but it didn't help it any. Well. It was because only like eighty dollars, and that wasn't actually broke. No, it was the gear that was broke. This was floating around on the shaft. Uh, so you wasted eighty bucks. And at one time, you could actually see it still in the, that spot, but that was a lot of miles ago. But okay. surprisingly, without nothing on here, you get about one percent of your mileage in your vehicle. So for every hundred miles, you get one mile. Something's spinning. So it's picking something. Up. I think it's just picking up the grease blowing around in a circle. <laughs> All right, so there's how you put your, your screwed up speedometer drive back on. Now, I pretty much had about a half a thou and one thou of press fit on both sides. Yeah. So that was total. So I'm pretty good at guessing what it takes to make things tight. Now, the sleeve retainer yeah. Loctite will hold mm -hmm. that pretty good. Yeah. But the one other thing that we're going to put on there just to make sure is we have the capillary action stuff. Because remember, we do have a split collar right here. Oh, he's going to put some juice between the crack. That probably sounded a bit rude. 
So that just sucks right in. See how it comes out the other side? Yep. Look at that. Look at that. So we're going to let that He's on the big set up words. overnight. Cap capillary. Yeah, we'll let that set up overnight and not screw with any more tonight. Oh, 10.30. Early nights, only 10.30. 10.30 for so early night for him. Hopefully that will never come out again. Yeah. Now, yeah. not all the people on the other end of this video are going to have that skill set. They're going to have to cut and taper this. They're going to have to make that. They're not going to come up. That. They're not going to have these parts to make it. I think you kind of, you know. That did take all day this yesterday. This is a one-off. That took all day yesterday to make that sleeve. And brilliant as you are, this is a one-off. And not many and people I was tired yesterday because I screwed it up three, two times. I, screwed I bet it up. if you even took this to, well, if you took this to a machine shop and said, I need to make one of these. Besides you, laughing out the door? Yeah, they'd be like, you know how much it's going to cost you for one of these? For me to make that for you? For this draft? I think you'd be better off uh, putting a you know, GPS on your car. Which everybody has nowadays, anyhow. Do they have a GPS? Everybody has GPS now. I always went by the speed was when those line markers really start blowing by real quick. It looks like, like Star Trek. Like, yeah. You're doing at least 80. Like a single line? Yeah, yeah I figure you're doing about 95 when you do it at that point. Mm -hmm. So I usually cruise with that. It works really good. But yeah. the cops kind of don't like it when you blow by them like they're sitting there. But you do get across country real quick, though. Yeah. Telephone poles look like a picket fence. Yes, that's from, you're hauling ass. That's from a... Uh, yeah, that works pretty good. That's from a, okay. All, All right, right, we're good for tonight. All righty, bye.